amidst the recession, there must have been some kind of hope and joy and the jazz age. This was the great event of the decade, the maiden voyage of the Queen Mary, and they put themselves on it. It really was the most wonderful ship. He was impressed with the decor, you know, the, the panels of the spindler pictures and the uh, engraved glass screens the bird's eye maple, and he just thought it was wonderful. And I think he thought, well, one day, wouldn't it be marvellous to furnish a cafe in this way? People would come from miles. They hire Trollope and Coles, who are the um, original sort of shop fitters who fitted out the Queen Mary, as well as the Grosvenor House Hotel in London and so on. I can really clearly see the vision that Frederick Belmont held in terms of wanting to recreate something that was like the stateroom on the Queen Mary. 